Thanks, Jack. Imagery is a core component of a modern GIS, and we'd like to share with you some of the new imagery capabilities in 9.4. Our strategy for providing you with increased imagery support is actually quite simple. It includes three key elements. The first element is a highly scalable image data management solution for working with large image catalogs. At 9.4, we've created a new type of raster catalog called a mosaic. Mosaic lives in the geodatabase. Here's an example of a mosaic for Toronto, Canada, which includes several hundred images and which represents a few terabytes of data. Mosaic allows you to keep your imagery in its native format and then dynamically access your original source imagery with on-the-fly orthorectification, mosaicing, and pan sharpening. This dynamic approach is a major step forward and it represents a unique capability that underpins our entire image strategy. It helps you eliminate many of the time-consuming intermediate steps associated with traditional approaches. One of the special advantages of imagery is that it makes our GIS real-time and up-to-date. So if we want to incorporate the latest available imagery into our mosaic, we can encapsulate that workflow with a simple model like this one, which leverages the full geoprocessing framework of ArcGIS. The model runs quickly, and in a few seconds, we see that we have several new full multispectral satellite scenes available. We can now access the new imagery, again, with on-the-fly orthorectification, mosaicing, and pan sharpening, and we can now get right to work on our project with the latest available imagery. This dynamic approach to image data management, the first element of our strategy, creates a foundation upon which you can build a highly scalable solution and which greatly reduces the latency or the time required between initial imagery acquisition and its operational use. The second element of our strategy are the new image display and analysis tools for the desktop. At 9.4, desktop becomes an image analyst workstation. And it includes a very powerful new image display capability featuring real-time roam, zoom, and rotation across imagery of virtually any size, any resolution, and any location. Thank you. 9.4 also includes a new image analysis window, which contains a number of new image enhancement and analysis tools that you've asked us for. They're all very easy to use, they're all in one place, and they operate in real time. You can perform image processing tasks, such as vegetation analysis, with a single click of a button. This NDVI analysis shows areas of healthy vegetation in bright yellow. If we look at the area in the center of the screen, we'll see what appears to be vegetation on the rooftop of a major building in downtown Toronto. We can take the results of this analysis and compare it back to our original image, but more on that in a moment. These tools do more than just operate on simple raster data. They can deal with many types of information. So for example, we can take LiDAR elevation data and very quickly re-render it as a color-shaded relief map. Image analysis workstation, as a second element of our strategy, provides a baseline for imagery exploitation and serves as a foundation for adding new imagery functionality. Now, remember the building with the vegetation on the roof? It turns out that Toronto has a very interesting campaign underway known as the Green Roof Movement, and this just happens to be one of them. This brings us to the third element of our strategy, which is leveraging the strengths of our key technology partners, such as ITT Viz and their Envy suite of software. We can use the Envy feature extraction module to automatically extract the roofs into the geodatabase using both the LiDAR and the multispectral imagery. We can also populate the database with the roof attributes, such as height, shape, area, and other characteristics. Finally, we can take this imagery-derived information and we can use it to drive our GIS suitability model 
to identify potential areas for green roof suitability. These are shown in green. We're very fortunate to have a large number of technology partners in the imagery world. And by working with all of them, it provides richness to this third element of our image strategy, and it allows you to unlock the powerful information contained in your imagery. By the way, our ESRI Canada office just happened to be in this data set. So just for fun, we decided to jump over to their location and see what was up. What we found was that their roof not only met our model's criteria for a green roof, they've actually already built one. Good job, Alex. <laughs> so in summary, these three key elements of our strategy, highly scalable image data management, the image analysis workstation, and working closely with our partners, are squarely focused on providing you with a complete imagery platform that brings imagery full circle as a core component to ArcGIS. Thank you very much.